let's take a look at the process of writing a repeated decimal as an improper fraction uh, using geometric series. The number 2.15 with the 1.5 repeating can be written using a geometric series. Here's how you do it. You pull apart the integer part, the part that's not a part of the repeating, and then for each chunk that gets repeated, you write it over the decimal place where uh, that number is. So, so 15 is over 100. The, other, the next 15 would be over to 10,000 because it's the fourth decimal place behind the, the, um, the decimal point. The next 15 will be over a million and so on. This pattern will continue. So how can we represent this as a geometric series? Well, what we can do is see that the way you get from one term to the next is by multiplying by a common ratio. That's what a geometric series is all about. As I go from 15 over 100 to 15 over 10,000, I multiply by 1 over 100. Okay, this part doesn't isn't included in this. The 2 isn't. 2 stands alone. And we deal with it from here on out. We have a geometric series. This ratio that we have as the multiplier from one term to the next, that's called R. When R is less than 1 in absolute value, the geometric series will converge. And we can find out what it converges to. It converges to A to a sum called A over 1 minus R. The value of A is what the first term is. Our first term is called A. And so all we need to do is take A and divide it by 1 minus R and we have what these infinitely many fractions will add up to. This 2 isn't considered part of the series and so that's not the first term. The first term is where the series actually starts at and for us that's going to be uh, here. So 15 over 100 is our first term. We divide that by 1 minus the ratio which is 1 minus 1 over 100. Well that just becomes 15 over 100 over 99 over 100 multiplying by the reciprocal the hundreds cancel out. And so what we get is uh, 15 over 99 and then that can be reduced by dividing by 3. So 5 over 33 is the representation of this infinite series of repeated numbers here as a fraction. So we're looking at 2 and 5 over 33. That's what this number is, 2.15 repeating. This is a mixed number, and we want it as an improper number, improper fraction that is. Well, you go from a mixed number to an improper by multiplying the denominator by the whole number and then adding the numerator. So 33 times 2 is 66. 66 plus the 5 is 71. So you end up with the final answer of 71 over 33. That's how you write this repeating decimal as an improper fraction. Any part that's not repeating, pull it off on the side. The part that is repeating, write it as uh, a, a series of fractions added together to give you a sum that you can find once you identify what the ratio is and what the first term is. Okay, great.